Hi there, this is a demonstration of our new Squarespace click tracking plugin. So, uh, it is super easy to install. Basically just copy paste couple of lines of code here, upload one file and you are set. Okay, I'm gonna demonstrate how it works. So, here we have our Google Analytics and here we have the website with the tracking installed. I've gone to the real-time section, real-time events, just so you can see the plugin in action. So, let's start clicking some links. Let's click the Amazon link and see. Whoops, something popped up. That's our link being tracked here. And the Amazon link has been tracked and it's in this outbound link click category. Okay, let's go back and click on a few other links. Amazon, eBay, an internal link to an about page, a file download, even a scroll to section, and an email link as well as an Instagram link and an image link. And here we see all of these clicks being tracked by Google Analytics, each one in their uh, specific category with the target tracked. And Google Analytics also tracks uh, the text of this thing that was clicked and it will track uh, the page you're in and all sorts of things like that. So here you can see it in real time, but of course all of this gets saved. So when you go to behavior and events, you will be able to see and filter all the specific clicks that you want. For example, maybe you have an affiliate site, you want to check out these outbound links and you want to see how much of them has been clicked within a specific time period and you can get uh, secondary information. You can uh, see where the click happened. For example, these all happened on the home page or you can see uh, what was the text of the thing that was clicked etc etc from these you can create goals so you can track your uh, conversion rates and see from uh, where your users came from uh, let's also take a look oh one more thing you can also save these you can save these reports for example these outbound clicks or you can just make a bookmark out of this place, get to it really easily. Now let's also take a look at the internal links. So these will be really useful for you to understand how your visitors navigate your site, as well as track any file downloads or email links, etc. A quick demonstration of the goals as well. So if you have one specific thing you want to track, for example, downloads of this zip file, you can create a goal for it and it is really easy. You'll just go to admin, goals, and here, for example, I have a goal created. For this one, you will just add the category. It begins with clicks. Uh, this isn't even necessary. And just the action, which is the target of the link, is the name of the file. And you can see that this event has been happening. So these will make it even easier to filter specific clicks if you're only interested in something that's really valuable to you. Thanks for watching. I hope you'll try out and get the plugin. Let me know if you have any questions. Thanks.